Hey guys, welcome back to another episode of Minecraft on my SMP server, I guess you'd call it. Uh, we never came up with a name, so it's kind of just me, my friends, um, we all play together. Um, today, I think we gotta start here. We're gonna kind of take a trip down memory lane and see how my YouTube career really started, because it did start on this server. Um, but it started before I started recording. So we're gonna start at the very beginning. See this? Okay, you see this room we're in? <laughs> and now crowded and tall, tiny it is. Uh, if you dig this up, which I'm about to do, this is where it all started. Um, this is a spider spawner. I think, yeah, we finally deactivated it. Uh, this is where <laughs> a lot of us came to do, um, came and dug out cobble, and I still come down here also to get cobble. Um, it's kind of just the miscellaneous chest down here. The first cave we went caving in, this kind of stuff, like, I didn't record, um, at this point, ah, I still hasn't chosen to do YouTube. So yeah, here you go, this is like the first place. And there's still stuff in here. Probably should come through and pick some of it out, over, just take it all. Um, it goes on even farther than that. And... While we were just starting this server, it wasn't something that I was like, oh my god, I have to, like, play, I need to do YouTube, and I, I had already helped start, set up spawn, and I was actually already building my main build before it evolved to what it is now. Let me cover this whole up. Okay. Um, these cows have kind of always been here, but here lies cow, one through four, die by creeper. These are the offsprings of cow, one through four, that survived. Uh, you've kept them in here ever since. When we started spawn, it did not look the way it does now. Uh, spent a lot of time working on spawn. Uh, both of these are my builds. Uh, as you see when we go inside this one, it's not done. I don't like what I was working on. I haven't really decided on one thing. Uh, both of these builds weren't here. They didn't exist. This land was all covered up. Yeah, see, we did a really bad job of covering stuff and... Yeah, there's lava under there. Um, just all around, it it needed so much more work. Okay, so we're here. I'm just I'm trying to see what's missing in here. Nothing. I finally finished this build. Okay. So, how this started originally was there was a fence around this portal. And that was it. Uh, and a fence and oh, this garden was there. And the garden went that way. I cleared out some of the garden. To build that but this was the official first big build of the server for me uh i made this giant cube in the nether um and designed this little hub area we wanted something i don't know to remind us of the outside and then i can't think of the way to do it so this is what i i settled on um and then there's portals that go all over the place okay so my polar bear is this way. Taka, I can't say his name because we don't use our our screen names on here, you know. Um, so this is to mine. This is the banner I made when banners came out. I love my banner design. Um, so let's go down here. So there's a lot of tunnels <laughs> running through here right now. Um, but this one, the one that looks like a tent, a creepy fun house. Realize I never actually finished up the portal on top. That's okay. Uh, it was the first big build, like not the big build, like not the first one, first main build. This was my base. Oh, I'm gonna go small for a second. You ready? <sighs> Tree. Um. Okay, no, don't go back in there. I just showed you out of the hole. You're not allowed to go in the nether. Go away. Okay. When it started, it didn't have all this. It was the first thing I ever built on the server, other than the hub, was this. Oh, God. It's a poorly designed house. These doors. Oh. The thing is, I won't change things. I like to see where I've come from. Um, this is it. I built a little bunkhouse. Uh, there's not much to it. It's just kind of a bunk place for everyone on the server. So when they come play mini games, they have a place to sleep. Outside design is really not that special. I could have done more. 
with it. Um, that's what I settled on right here. So this is the first build. Little bunkhouse. Second build is this place. Um, I built it. It didn't have a purpose. And someone's eaten everything in my chest. I had cookies in there and a bunch of pumpkin pie and cake. I need, I guess, to replenish that chest. It is whatever. I've got a whole farm set up. Well, technically, this wasn't the second build. This was the first. And the official second build was this square right here. It used to be comprised of a lot of stuff. Um, so that pastry build, pastry shop is kind of what I considered it. Cake shop. And that's why it's got pumpkin pie. It's kind of like a pastry shop. It was the second build. And I made this chicken place. Which someone turned off my chicken grinder. Uh, so it was out of the chicken. So it's just a chicken grinder. Um, there's actually a tutorial I found online to build this. Just makes chickens. Uh, the first two buildings are actually done when I started doing YouTube, I think. So after all of that, you know, bunnies came into the game. So I got bunnies. This is all farm. Uh, this is my main area to go and farm. Uh, everything and anything. Uh, see, there's there's everything in here. It's watermelon way down there and trees in this room and nether war. It it's a huge area. What? Why are you in here? Death. Come here, bunny. I don't, who let all of my rabbits out? Okay. I don't know why they were down here of all places. I know they can hop this. Someone almost had a carrot and then hopped over it. Um. Alright, so it started out small. A few cows, a few pigs, a few sheep. And then it turned into the giant thing you see today. Um. You know, storage always starts out small. This ends up being my storage every time. Huge, giant, and well organized because I can't see it any other way. Um, as we progress, this bed was actually down here near my set, set of armor. And when the armor came into play, the armor stands that got moved down here because it actually was supposed to be up there closer. But this all is in here. Ah! Really? Two Silk Touch and a Fortune 3 in a row? I haven't been on this server in a while. Okay, so, uh, this kind of is where I, everything's a little hidden back in this corner. Um, just so that everything was out of the way. Um, the bed got put here and there's this little trash thing. Found cocoa. There is sheep of every color. Oh yeah, my dog. He just, he can't go with me anymore because he died. <laughs> once and I had to replace him so he just stays there uh yeah sheep of every color this this took a long time this is my rainbow road right here people and a lot of work a lot of separation of sheep and then this happened there are a lot of colors of purple see this is all magenta and then somebody mixed my blue sheep and my purple sheep. Then these ones are okay. So I didn't realize that until just now. Someone must have breeded weird. Um, you gotta be careful when you breed because they're so close to each other. They can breed through the fence. Oh, I thought they were mixed. Nope, they're just hanging out. Um, we're gonna fix that really quick. But I need to breed up blue sheep. Um. Yeah, this, this was like, it's like, I know I have a whole chest of wheat someplace, or I did at one point, I used a lot of it on this. You know, this is, okay, so essentially this is my main base, right? This is where I come, hang out, get all my supplies, anything I need, it's probably going to be down here. Um, if you're going to see how many places I am currently at. You will understand more. You're gone. You're gone. You're gone. You're gone. Where did the blue sheep? You 
no purple sheep. And like you have to legitimately make sure they're all done with their hearts before you read in another pen. And a lot of times you have to do every other and then come back. Eh, set up something best. I could have come with a better way, and I think next time I have to build a rainbow road, I will come with a better way because I end up with cross sheep all the time. Some people don't know, and my builds are free for other people on our server to use. So on occasion, more than on occasion, uh, some people just don't know how to read them the right order. Um, down here, well. I haven't busted this open in a while. Um, it's actually my original cave. Uh, this was actually... You can tell... Down here. I will show you what I have. Can you hear all the water? It's not a perfect system. It doesn't work all the time. But it worked enough for what I needed. So, I can't remember where I need to stand to make it work. You may have to stand up here. Um, it's a spider, a spider grinder, a mob farm. Okay, let's see if any will pop in, if you can see them. Okay, you see the spider thing in there. Um, the water... If they fall, pushes them down the hole and keeps them from climbing back up. Um, it's slow. It's not the best system. But it worked for what I needed. Uh, at the time, I was collecting string or something. I don't really remember what. Once I finished all that, though, I really haven't come down in here. Because this, as you can tell, everything's been cleared out. I did a very good job of cleaning it out. I took... Everything, the wood and all, um, because that's just kind of how I cave. I don't leave anything behind. This is actually blocked off so that uh, you can get to the the bunnies. I need to put a sign, I guess, eventually. Oh yeah, and then I collected two villagers, and they're over here. This is just chickens, and they have overfilled this thing you take eggs out and more eggs come in it's probably about time to murder those chickens that's all they do they just make eggs I need them for something all right this is place upon strip mining so my strip mines they collect it in um, so I started caving in here. As you can tell, it's a lot more lava than anything. And I built these paths in here. Um, this is cool when it decides it wants to work. It must be working when I'm around. Um, it's a slime ball generator. Oh, a slime ball, like spawning thing. So slimes spawn on these three platforms. Uh, they will come towards you. So you stand, you gotta stand farther away though, because they'll bounce around here and they're gonna fall down, and then they're gonna hit those signs. The signs force them into this water stream, and they can't bounce back. There's too many, they can't. But it kills them, it drowns them, and then puts them down in here. It drops their slime balls off. Um... Yeah, I think this is what this room's all about down here. Uh, it's just a bunch of yeah, just a bunch of little random stuff. Things you might need: bed, just in case everyone else on the server wanted to sleep, and you're out here grinding away at slime balls. Okay, so then after this build, uh, most of this build was built periodically between everything else. Okay, um, this is just the main part. We haven't got to like the rest of this area. So when we got on the server, the first thing I was like, I want to build is a theme park. Okay, so that's why we have these three little, sh two little shops, Ooh, two little shops, and then, actually I think it's unpeaceful, so it's playing with settings. Two little shops, and then, uh, the bunkhouse. So this is the 
this is what I built originally. Uh, this is one of the first things, this little tent idea actually came back into the nether after I had built this. Um, so you come here and you stand here and you throw iron. At the, you aim it at the wood and it ends up going here. Uh, it goes underneath the system and then potions shoot up at you. They are good, bad, or whatever. I know I tried to ask for the bottles back and not everyone, no one returns them. Okay. After that, king of the ladder. I uh, look, they all kind of have signs. This is the one that doesn't, because I kind of decided it was like a gypsy tent type thing, where it didn't need the sign. Uh, so, King of the Ladder. Um, I never quite finished it, but it was playable. Because I would have liked to have redone all the walls, but it's playable. Um, it's not all the way up to the, the top. And it's pretty close to the bottom. But we said it was big enough. The lava is the only real dangerous part. If you fall in it, you will die. I've done it a couple times. And this piece of lava, I think, actually had covering over it at one point. But uh, somebody in the server brought a creeper through and blasted through that wall. Um, then if you go through here, because it's not done yet and I haven't finished the path, it's actually a fishing game. Uh, there's stuff in there, and then I made this fishing pond. So that you come out here and fish and kind of create a game out. There's like a scoreboard on the chart. Based on rarity of fish, it might have to change in the new update when we update to it. But, yeah, you, know, you know, the point is set a timer on your own, uh, time it out, and you fish so you can get as many, as many points. Okay, these look weird, I know. Like, but this is what's underneath, and the pumpkin looks even weirder than the carpet. So I just stick with the carpet. Okay, next thing I built is this. It never got its sign. But essentially, it's Jurassic Park. I need this. Okay. Um, I kind of liked the, the Jurassic Park ride. Oh my god. When we were in D no, Orlando. That means they've been flying over the fence. That's the only reason I have eggs everywhere. It's because these guys like to, uh, Come out of their area. So make new ones all the time. Okay, so essentially, you're not supposed to climb on the fences, but everyone knows you can. So you're supposed to go in here, go in the water, and take it as slow as you want, run on it, I don't care. Um, this is going to be like the good guys, the herbivores, the dinosaurs that won't hurt you type thing. You go down here. Um, this even says, please sprint. Um, it's dangerous down here. This is about as much light as you get. And hopefully no one broke anything. But if you're around in here enough, mobs spawn all in here, and they they will attack you because I'm peaceful. They won't they attack you. There's little corners you see where I've I built a lot of this caving structure. I'd like to have done it a little different. I think now when I think about it, see like this is just a big like it's supposed to look like a spawning a spawner. But I couldn't find a spawner when I wanted to build it. Or I put it had a spawner in there. Uh, you yeah, guys see, like, those redstone torches actually is the only thing that gives off light. Except in there. Somebody put a real torch in there. Excuse me, torch. Where does this go? Oh. Okay, this is part of that huge cave structure. Um, you probably were supposed to be more up here, just so that I think I opened it so that light would come in, but not that much. There we go. Uh, yeah, if you look up in here, there's probably like a redstone torch in there, and back in there. Like, they're kind of hidden, so you couldn't see them. Okay, so, like, you'd have to run through here, because creepers will blow up, and then you jump, and you hold the jump button all the way up this ladder. I just did a water elevator that you normally use for mobs. And you can go up it just as easy. Um, and it ends up in the bottom of the building when you get there. It's kind of long. You drop pretty far. I didn't realize how far we dropped down. I just want to make sure we dropped down far enough to... 
Okay, so yeah, you come back up in here. It's not well decorated down here. Um, and you're back on the top of the ride. Okay, so I, I kind of wanted this, like, theme park mini game area, right? All right, then... Wasn't this one that was next? It's this big one back here. Look how big... Okay, let's see if I can go over here and show you guys. Like, how big I built this one. See, it goes all the way over there. Okay, um, we're gonna come through the entrance like you're supposed to. Most of my time. Okay, so this this is Battleship. Um, this one took a little bit of creativity and a little bit a lot of work. Um, as you can see, there was probably montages of me building these walls, and I tried to make it as random as possible. Um, so yeah, you know, there's the general rules. How you choose a side? We're gonna end the blue side. Just I'm gonna go on both because the ground the floor is actually different. Okay, so they all they they have they both have the silver pattern. See, this is orange and red over here. Um, this one got this the oh, is this the andesite or is this the diorite? Andesite because it was it has those blue tinges to it to match this light blue glass, um, light block. You can be able to, you should be able to see each other. So there's this to like drop your stuff if you don't want to hold on to it. A lot of times I get rid of my stuff when we played games. And here's the box of buttons. There's enough buttons to fill this whole entire thing. In I think there's actually extra. So there's a lot of blocks. These circles stone or chiseled stone blocks are really expensive. Um you go up here. And if I had more TNT, I could really show you guys. We get one five TNT space, one four TNT space, two three space TNTs and one 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 two so here's you take your TNT and you line up just like battleship like one two three and you spread them out everywhere um if you hop up here you can cheat and it's more about like your integrity your honor same thing on this side it's actually one less TNT in this one I've played it once this I didn't like I did not like putting these up here but I needed them for down below and I was like eh you're not going to see them that much. I can sacrifice. You needed them down here to light it up. Okay, so this is this is cool. This is probably my favorite one. Is that I went and got... This is individual buckets of lava. So it doesn't make that weird flowy look. Like water, you know, it's easy. Lava was a lot harder. I like how... I really liked how it came out. Um, Nice flow. So it was like a water versus lava. Red versus blue. Uh, idea. Um, I tried to stick with this gray coloring for inside other than like these so that it had this like there's the there's the andesite block and then we didn't use what was this the granite in the wall because i i felt like it was too rough comparatively so we use this is white stained clay i think like gray stained clay because it gave that same color kind of a little bit less bright i didn't want to brighten the walls too terribly much but it kind of gave both the colors and the rest of them are just your neutral grays and like some cobble like the building's been beat up it's a battle area so it's actually the um second like the next big thing i built this was huge several hours of planning and working on it but i it was fun when we played it once uh i got to get more tnt so i can play it again this one was the next one i built um I don't know. I kind of was derpy with the design. I, I liked this, but I don't really like the rest of it. And I never really felt like changing it after that. Um, down here is just supplies. But, and I never put the rules in here, which I guess I should probably go ahead and do soon. Um, you hear all the lava under here. These are two blocks, no blocks. Um, if you guys watch Generic B, you would know this game. Uh, or seen the, the stuff. I can't remember what he called it. Uh, it might be like Snowfall or something. But you take... I can show you guys with one. Uh, there'd be like two of you, there'd be like a couple of you guys playing. It's, I think we played with three. That was a lot of fun. Um, and you'd go out here and you're all, we all started in different corners. And it's like leaf spleef. And you'll have to move once and then you have to place. And it turns into a snow golem and they burn to death down there. And then you can't fall in the lava. So you really don't want too much too many pumpkins on you but there's, that's why there's pumpkin farm below um the next thing i was working on let's just go up on top of this building is this hedge maze 
that's really hard to see. Um, it's not finished. That's actually, I think, a chest of netherrack. Uh, I need to go through and still finish my hedges and stuff, so the hedge maze will be finished. Um, at the point where I started working my hedge maze, I started getting really bored at this build. And I wanted something else to work on. So I left, actually, and I came back, and this is what I built. This is actually, I wonder if my pigs are still alive. Um, pig races. My carrot on the sticks are dying down here. Um, pig jousting. You have a pig and a sword and a carrot on the stick. You take pig up and attack each other as you pass. First to three strikes wins. Um, the first one to hit each other three times will win. So one's going to start on each one side and you're just going to go, 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 and you're going to swing at each other the whole way. Uh, but if you put away the carrot on the stick, the pig doesn't want to necessarily go forward, so you have to really time when you're going to switch over. Uh, I haven't had a chance to play it. Most people, most of them on here by myself, as you can see, I'm on here by myself. Um, nine times out of ten, you're going to be on the server on your own. Just because we all are on different schedules, we try our best. This is when new fences actually came out. New fence colors. I was testing them all out next to each other, and I never took them down. There's a lot of stuff like that around in my area. Oh, then I built this. Just got some horses in it. It's got a lot of people's horses in it. It's the only place, I think, on the server where there's a stable. So, collected a lot of people's horses in there. And a lot of people, not only they leave them here, they take them other places. Okay. So, the next place has never been finished. The pl and the last place has never been finished. What I'm going to do is, I'm going to head there, and then we'll be back. So, you guys don't have to watch this incredibly long run. You guys can see the layout, you know from this thing it's not even finished but okay this is where we've headed to this is a life built um i have this really great idea that i haven't really started and it took me a long time we finally got out to this island we are really 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 far away from where we were originally you can see here's everything we need for a wither fight which will be happening hopefully soon at the bottom of this this is actually going to be a rapture build from bioshock um let me say it was from bioshock one and two why is this all filled in obviously i did this I don't know why I can use the dirt though. Whew. Oh, okay. I was trying to get cobble. It's going a little cobble crazy. Um, I think I'm pretty sure I went caving down there. I don't have a bucket. I think I do. Oh, no bucket. But if I had a bucket. I'll be able to show you. Um, that goes down pretty deep, as you can see. Uh, the wither fight will be down there. Thing is, whatever goes down last has to cover the hole. Uh, this will be a lighthouse. That will be a lighthouse where the end of the portal inside is gonna be a lighthouse. Um, it's gonna have below under all this water. So I chose an island. I'm going to build Rapture, and hopefully within the next year, this is where I start. Um, this is going to be a huge build. Um, but as you can tell, once I get down there, um, I'll get, it's all going to be underwater. And I think there's actually something on 1.9 that I'm really excited about. The reason I kept being hesitant is that water flows really weird against glass. You can see it flow on the inside, which has always been strange to me. And I read someplace that 1.9 update that it's not going to do that anymore. And hopefully that's true. Um, I have more build to show you guys, and I realized when I was at the other place that how much I rambled for no reason. So, I will catch you guys at the other, the other place, or last place to show you, because it's actually, it's actually really far away from everything else. Um, okay guys, this is the last build, um, I don't know how hard it is for you guys to see it from over here, but, it's all glass. 
Um, I'm actually building a farming community. Sorry, I've got particles. I got a speed potion so I can run faster. Um, on this server, <laughs> I'm, not gonna, I'm totally just gonna cloud say we are not above cheating every once in a while. Um, well, I think almost everybody on the server has got mod powers except the the children for the one child. Um, this is the second level as far as I've gotten. This is a lot of off camera work. I have not even revealed it until now. So congratulations, this guys, you get to see it. Um, a lot of work off camera. I still lit this whole section up. So nothing grows here yet. Lit most of this up. Um, yeah, the, the dirt in the middle. I think of every section. Um, is like that. Because the water just doesn't quite reach. It's still gross. The water just doesn't always come all out here. Once I light all this up, this whole level will be wheat. The one above it will be wheat. And then I think we're going to do some potatoes and carrots all in this one building. The plan is to have a couple more glass towers. It's going to stay in this ice spikes biome. I think the next one is going to be more up here. Uh, I made a deal with one of the guys on the server because he's actually taking some of this packed ice as long as he leaves it alone where I'm at. I don't mind. Uh, yeah. eep, eep. It's really hard to get over this mountain. Uh, the thing is, I'll be building a path up it so it's not as difficult. I don't know why it's so hard to get up here. Yeah, I've got a second speed motion and I'll put like, a milk so I don't want it anymore. Uh, the second, next one I'm thinking is either going to be up here or it's going to be like in this area someplace. Uh, if you come over this mountain, see this ice spikes biome isn't huge. Um, but we don't have, I couldn't find another one. This is the first one I ran into. There's his portal, but it goes that way. I think we've pretty much said that if he goes to the right of his portal, um, we'll be fine. I stick to the left, he sticks to the right. Um, this is not even the portal I used to get here. Because, see, it goes that way, a distance. I just wanted this this corner here. You can see he's taken out, taken out some, which that is fine. Um, I still need to let some columns loose in this area. Just to, ice, to sand it. Ah! Oh, snow it over some more. Yeah, this speed potion is killing it. Killing the food. Uh, the point is just to kind of have a community build out here. Uh, for everyone to have a chance to get as much wheat as they need, as long as they replant it. And same with carrots and potatoes. I'm going to have a pumpkin and melon farm, and a sugarcane and cactus, and then cow, pig, and sheep are all going to have their own, and chicken grinder, maybe, chicken farm, and they're going to be scattered amongst these hills, there's going to be, um, paths that lead between them all, uh, I've really said kind of material I want to use, um, but all of them will be glass with the spruce, and then the smooth stone, and dirt that you'll see on the outside. Uh, they all have these kind of stairs. This one's gonna be the biggest one because I have two layers, two or three layers of wheat. Um, I need room for these. They are set up instead of down in them for a reason. They just look cleaner, in my opinion. Like instead of being down one, because these are actually on the top half, so they stick out. They look cleaner because they're tucked in. They still let off a good amount of light. Uh, they're not playing in any fashion. They're kind of just stuck up in the ceiling. Um, so that's about it. Uh, actually, I have one more thing to show you guys. That's a spawn. Uh, we'll run there together. And I'll talk about it. Um, kind of the plans in the next year, how we're going to do uh, Minecraft. Uh, okay, there we go. Yeah, in there, 8 frames. Out here, 34 or 23. It's fluctuating. Yeah, I left for a little bit, had to come back, so now we're back on easy. The game is normally set on easy, I forgot to flip it back. After adjusting some video settings. Oh god. Oh god. Oh god. Oh god. Oh god. Oh god. Go, 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 go.
This is why I don't like being in the nether. Oh, my path is okay because it's all cobble. So we're just gonna go down here. Oh, yeah, another 32 seconds on the speed rush. Gotta go fast, baby. Um. Go as fast as I can. Um. Yeah, that, that path's not really that far. I still haven't decided on design there yet. Oh god, there's so many of them. Why are there so many? So we're gonna back out here. We're gonna talk about spawn uh, quickly. This is actually a relatively... This is one of the last things I was really working on before I stopped building on the server for a while. I was getting bored of Minecraft. The ceiling is blue glass uh, set in a... Kind of like a dome. You can tell better on the outside. Uh, so it matches this. Um, see, this isn't, I don't like this all that much. I need to come up with a nice design. I like these, but I don't like that. It's too bulky on the outside. This is a Jenny V design. The sign blocks go up in, like, there's, they, they go up in here. Um, like under here is slime blocks. This is, it's just too bulky out here. Um, and I don't really like that. So we're going to take it down. We're going to redo it again. I like, kind of like this, but it just feels too bulky, if that makes any sense. Uh, that's why the only one side is done. Not both. Why is there a hole? Um, and then after I was working on this for a while, I work, was working on just that one half. It never was supposed to be this big. And it turned into this giant thing. I had built this. Uh, it's a little potion. It's a bookshop. I had stuff in some of these chests. It's a lot of them are. If they're labeled. I had stuff in them. Uh, see this wall. You're supposed to pay. An iron and a lapis. I must have taken. Used all my power one. Or not brought them out here. And there's a hopper underneath here. So you throw it in there. Over here this wall is two iron and two lapis. That means it took me two lapis to get whatever is in these chests. Um, just asking for lapis in return. And then this wall... We got three iron and your three lapis, which I never got anything that really that took that much. But I like the design of this building. Why is that there? Oh no, it's supposed to be there. Okay, yeah, 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 it's supposed to be there. Okay, um, it looks cooler out here. Okay, the outside's all calm. Okay, right. um, we did, I liked this with the green, it says we did vines, um, I actually built this in a creative world, and I was kind of playing with the idea of it, and so it kind of looks like a temple, that was my goal, let's see this temple-y look, I really liked, so on the inside you have fence, and the outside you have fence, so it was kind of a mirror image idea when I did it, uh, there's green, Behind there, uh, it, it grows down a lot of times. I have to come through, especially with that one and trim it back. I actually didn't mean to break that one, but that's okay. It's actually probably easier to get it out now. Um, a few vines in here, not too many, just to keep it. And then in here, it was just supposed to be kind of a mishmash of cobble and diorite, like as everything was falling apart, bookshelves, and all the chests. Um, I tried to give it this temple esque feel. Uh, kind of trapped in. Uh, I liked the orange doors a lot. Um, so that's it, guys, for our little server tour. As a recap of things that I've been working on and doing, and of all that stuff that's been happening. Uh, these are actually taken from a base of someone who doesn't play with us anymore, so they were kind of like freebies. Uh, 
I hope you guys enjoyed. Wow, there's a lot of stuff in this chest. I uh, will catch you guys in about two weeks. Uh, every other week should be a Minecraft episode from here. And hopefully in the off weeks will be episodes from Nice or maybe some mini games or whatever I really feel like doing that week. Um, I'll check you guys later.